friend came and picked him up. They drove down to the San Francisco area. They met up with another friend. They were drinking and they were smoking. They went back to the friend's apartment at about three in the morning, went to bed, and Kevin didn't wake up. What did you learn had happened? Uh, what, what caused Kevin's death? He, the toxicology report came back as multiple drug intoxication. So he had mixed alcohol, uh, ethyl alcohol, morphine, and codeine, and that it said 6 MAM present. So I didn't know what any of that meant. Um, I would later learn that that's how heroin breaks down in the body. The thing with stigma is that there's so much judgment that goes around. I couldn't share the cause of death with anybody, and I didn't tell my family, I didn't tell my parents, I didn't tell anybody for two years. I, I think that my dogs were the only ones I really felt 100% comfortable around, because there's no judgment, yeah. right? No there's judgment, no judgment. Right. And that's what I felt that was such a big part of my grief, was the judgment and the shame and the, you know, it was like just this lead, lead blanket on me. And they were yeah. like, we, we love you. We think you're wonderful. 